We've all heard it. Times are tough. I can't get a job. Nobody's hiring in this economy. Everyone wants to complain. But I have an important, life-changing message for those who do. Get it together and have your rich dad hook you up with a job at his company. Put your nose to the grindstone and say, Dad, fine, I'll come work for you. Today I have three harsh truths for you. Harsh truth number one, everyone needs to stop making excuses about how hard it is to find a job and just go get a job at their dad's dog food company. Harness the power of your dad. I know what you're thinking, but Philip, I hate my dad. I get it. I hate my dad too. Which brings me to harsh truth number two. You can't just expect your dad to give you a job. A great resume always stands out. Make sure to write your name on it so the lady in HR realizes that your dad is her boss. Of course, the resume is just a formality, but if your dad finds out that you didn't do your resume right, he's gonna be pissed. Trust me. Then there's the job interview. For some people, the job interview is a mountain of pressure. Everything inside of you will want to yell, listen, just shut up and give me the job, idiot. But you can't for some reason. Instead, try this great interview tip I heard from my dad. If you just buy a goddamn suit, show up on time, and don't mouth off for once, I'll hire you. Don't be afraid to try that yourself. So, now that you've got the job, you're on easy street, right? Wrong. You're gonna have to start from the bottom. I worked in the mailroom of my dad's company, managing the mailroom. It took me three months, well, two and a half months, to rise up and become head of some kind of sales or something. But put in those hours and you can go to your dad with confidence and demand a better job. Of course, a lot of people, the old guard of your dad's work, won't like you coming in and changing things up. His name is Brian, and he wanted to be the boss of the company because he worked in that department for 20 years or something. But here's how you deal with the Brians of the world. Tell him to shut up, and you make him work in the dog food factory. Also, don't be afraid to network. Talk to your dad's friends. Try and turn them against your dad by lying about things your dad said. They might give you a better job. You never know. Finally, harsh truth number three. Work freaking sucks. But if you put in some effort and you just tune out your dad's BS for a couple of years, eventually he'll die and you'll be in charge and he'll be dead. Thank you.